You've quoted Proust and Socrates to try. Thank you. You've quoted Proust and Socrates to try and get her on her knees, but all you got was coffee running through you. But if you want her on her back, next time try a different tack. The poon procuring Cadillac, hallelujah, hallelujah. Spelling. <laughs> Ask the Jew next to you what that means. <laughs> Blackbird is a worthy choice to display your sweet guitar and voice. Imagine is another that would do you. But if you want the coup de grace for the pinnacle of panty loss, it's the Cotton melting anthem, hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Oh. Of course. I mean the Cohen song, the one that's 14 verses long, but you wouldn't spring for sheet music, you Julia. <laughs> you knew that a Jews can do that. No Goyim can sing the song though. Unless you convert. But you knew that you would make her wet when you stole it off the internet. The approximated corn to hallelujah. For whom you had the hots, you got her huffing Jaeger shots. She did a beer bomb while exclaiming, Booyah! <laughs> There's no beverage at a bar to show a girl how hot you are, like saying, My favorite song is home. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. I want to apologize in advance for this verse. It's the kind of line that my writer was very excited about. But my singer was very upset with my writer at being asked to sing it in public. But the fact is, the singer knows that it's possibly the best line the writer has ever written and the worst at the same time, which is saying a lot because this writer has written a lot of extremely bad lines. But this, I think, head and shoulders above the rest. Right? Think of this as a Coons exhibit. K, artist. Hi. You gotta be careful, because I'm pushing buttons. There's certain buttons that if you think I'm pushing, that I'm not pushing, that, that one thing, it's like the Pope, he does, he does that one thing. He visited 
he visited, you know, a harpy lady who, uh, you know, the gay marriage lady, and suddenly everyone's like, oh, what a dick. But before that, he was golden. I gotta be careful not to do any dickish things on this stage. Too late. <laughs> well, this verse is gonna take care of that. All right. <laughs> you brought her flowers, you bought her meal. Sure that that would seal the deal. But no matter what you tried, she never blew you. <laughs> but now you've got the golden goose. You're on a master cleanse of pussy juice. Since you started singing hallelujah. I told you, hallelujah. Disclaimers always count now. Thank you so much for joining me in that. All right. I'd like to call...